Hello and welcome to another edition of Keto Kyle's Kitchen. Today we'll be making coconut crack bars. If you're on a keto diet and you have a big hankering for something sweet, these are the best. I eat these all the time. They're very healthy and they do the job, especially when you've got a big sweet tooth. So we don't need very, very many things to make them. Uh, we've got about a cup and a half of coconuts. Uh, these are unsweetened coconuts. I have uh, pecans. I use a food processor on those. This is uh, coconut oil, organic coconut oil. And then this here is the real hard one here. It's monk fruit sweetened maple syrup. You gotta get this on Amazon. That's what makes it. I like throwing a little pink Himalayan salt. And uh, can't forget the MCT oil. And a little stevia for good luck. All right, let's get started. Got the coconut flakes. We're gonna go ahead and add some nuts. I'm gonna go ahead and just pour my one cup of coconut oil in. I like like the eyeball eyeball stuff anymore. I'm getting really good at these recipes, so I'm just eyeballing. So after we get that in there, I'm gonna put a little. Salt in. One, two, three dabs of stevia. And some MCT oil. Alright, what we we'll do is we're going to mix it up with our hands. Quick and easy. Nothing too crazy. Alright, we got our, we got our uh, mixture here all worked up. I have some silicone molds here I got on Amazon. I use those for my peanut butter candy and everything. I'm just going to lay that mixture down in there and I'm going to spread it out. I like to get a little bit in all the holes, the squares. Now when we, when we're done with this, we're going to put this in a freezer for about 30 minutes to an hour or however long you want. Any, any time longer than that would be okay because what this is going to do is solidify not solidify it's going to harden it's going to harden up and they're going to be just like candy bars when we're done it's going to be good all right them looks good see see how they are so we're going to pop these in the freezer for 30 minutes to an hour and then when they're done we're just we'll just take that silicone mold and break them out in little pieces and enjoy thanks guys for tuning in to watch me again I know it's been a couple weeks since I put a good video out it's because I only eat my recipes that I make so it takes me a couple weeks to find something new to eat Okay, well, thanks for watching, and uh, next time, tune in to Keto Kyle's Kitchen, where no carbs is no problem.